Here we go. Alright. That's the lever. The beam, I'm sorry. Open. And... Alright. Come on, come on! Okay, so, so, so far it's working. Now quickly. Over here. Over here. Oh, come on. Oh my god, the, the, this thing won't let me. Well, the abilities don't last forever. The bar the tough. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. This thing is. Ugh, I, I want to get rid of it. But I can't. Wait! Wait! The sarcophagus! Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Okay, hang on, I'll be back. Now run, quickly. Alright, now enter. And, and wait for the electric thing to work. And now, yeah, there we go. By the way, I didn't say hi guys, I'm back because I was too... I get, I get, I get too absorbed into the, into the new thing I, I, I discovered. That, that I stupidly forgot about the uh, sar sarcophagus back there. Take the object, yes. And now let's put the earth key in there. Is key, earth key. And we, and we have another key. That will open the, the lock. So we'll be able to actually get out of here. There we go. Use item. Exit key. Alright, get in there! Ha! It worked. Ah, it worked! And there, and there and there's a treasure chest. What is that? Whoa. This looks beautiful. You found the wings of Ibis. Uh, yeah. Wait, is it starting to get back? Wait, what? What the hell just happened? Did it just evaporate or something? Whoa. Oh, and then and we're back here. What? What the hell? Oh, okay. I, I guess it starts here, and and every time we get a canopic jar, we we get we get to play as him and then continue in the castle. So and now, now we're gonna go back to Sphinx, right? Yeah, we are. What have we here? It's one of the stolen jewels of Abydos. I knew something suspicious was going on. I must find out exactly what treachery is afoot. Ah, this is very interesting. The prince has managed to find the lost wings of Ibis within the castle. It is an ancient magical artifact that was stolen a long time ago. It gives the owner the agility of a bird, enabling them to jump greater heights and longer distances. Keep basket with you now, as well as these items. I'm sure they will be very useful in your quest. If you had the Book of the Dead, you could save the basket to to to, to conquer when you find a canopic vase. Uh, the film book may be in the cursed palace somewhere, so perhaps you go and speak to Anubis about the palace's unfortunate inhabitants. Or else I already left to visit him, but I see your fate and his are diverging now. 
Alright. So, now what? We have the wings of Ibis. They can form a second jump to reach greater heights and, long and longer distances. Alright, you got 35. Uh, okay. Oh, wow. The, the, this looks cool. Alright, there's a portal here. And can we get back out? Yeah. Yeah, we can. Alright, and I believe there, there there's a safe point right here and uh Yeah. Right, right out here. Okay, wow, um this recording session has been way longer than than I than I anticipated. So I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy Blind. Yeah, I, I didn't know, I didn't mention the uh, blind at the at the begin at the beginning of the at the beginning of the episode when I said welcome back to Let's Play. I said Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy with that without the blind part. So okay, so I'll see you. <laughs> I'll see you next time on Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy Blind. In the next episode, we're gonna. We're probably gonna go uh, to the to, to the cursed tower where 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 Horus went uh, with the, with, the, with the new ability we got. So I'll see you then. Bye now.